And so as a leader, I'm really more proud about creating other leaders. Joe Hooks has made it his personal mission to give back to the community that he says gave so much to him. It's a, uh, you know, building leaders, you know, and uh, really teaching that humility um, and just showing that we care. It's not always about sports, but it's just about what we can do for others. This Montgomery Village native graduated from Watkins Mill High School and went on to play football at Shepherd University. When his hopes of playing for the NFL didn't pan out, Hooks became a coach at his old high school and started the 480 Club a nonprofit for student athletes that offers training while at the same time teaching important life lessons to reach and inspire young people. Sports taught me a lot, you know, it taught me um, teamwork, you know, in this world, you know, we have to be a team to get things done, communication, uh, brotherhood, being dependable for each other. And like I tell them, every day we come out here, it's like a new play. We have to adapt on the fly. Um, we have to, we have to survive. Go. Go. We have to, uh, you know, uplift each, uplift each other. You know, we have to um, be flexible with, you know, with our skills and football, just perseverance. Come on, finish up. Hooks has become a hero of sorts to the adolescents in the community. Not only is he making an impact by giving the youth options to grow. You get a couple of bananas, a couple of breads, a couple of apples, a couple of potatoes, and just grab a pie. He's showing them what it means to be a part of the community. Every week since June at Montgomery Village Middle School, Hooks organizes a food drive for families who are suffering due to the pandemic. I wanted to show, show positivity, show love, show service. Take care. People trust who they trust. And we first started, I wanted them to see a familiar face, to see an African-American man um, lead um, and serve whoever. And that's what it's about. And we've had anyone and everybody, any color, any diversity, come get food and change the narrative. He's recruited members of his 480 club to come out and pack up the food and supplies and take part in distributing the groceries to the families who line up hours before the drive begins. Oh, is that the line back there? <laughs> oh, oh, shoot. Young kids I have, you know, just need some positive influence. So I felt we talked twice a week. Um, you know, I thought this was a good way to have some interaction safely and uh, really build some strills up. So, you know, when it gets warmer, we'll do some sports stuff and just know that's bigger than sports and, and we can do more things. In addition to his advocacy with the 480 Club, Hooks has done work as a community outreach truancy prevention coordinator with the Montgomery County State's Attorney's Office, where he helps students improve their attendance and grades. I started to realize what the, what the government can do for the community. I can't imagine living in another county. He believes it's imperative to build these young men up and help them understand the role they play in the future of their community. I want them to remember that they can come together, put positivity back out there instead of negativity. These kids are on social media and they don't have the guidance as much without being in school. And this is a safe place where they can hear a less of a like angry tone about what's going on, and, but also acknowledge it and to let them know that Hey, did you see what's on the news? Give them a hug, ask them how you're doing, you know, meet them where they are. And so as a leader, I'm really more proud about creating other leaders.